you and I have been running around all day. I ran into James Harrison. He had a lot to say, and this was a fun conversation. Here with former Patriot James Harrison. How we doing, James? Doing good. How you yeah. doing? You have talked a long time about how you were surprised at how great a teammate Tom Brady was. I mean, tell that story again. What made him such a great teammate? Uh, he's genuine. He's, uh, you know, he, he really cares about, you know, each person. And it's like, it's real. You know, it's not, it's not what you see just on, uh, you know, on camera. It's not an act. So, uh, you know, I was hoping to come in, you know, to be honest with you. And I'm like, hey, I'm about to see a real a-hole here. Like, he, he can't hide it no more. And it was a uh, total opposite. So his success, I would imagine, once you got to know him, I mean, even at this age, doesn't surprise you? No. No, no, especially with the things he does as far as the study habits. I mean, like I said, I've never seen anybody with the study habits he has. Talk about what you're doing here, what you're running around talking about, your brand, and what you're doing outside of football. Uh, I actually, I have, uh, you know, I'm an analyst for Fox. Um, I'm getting into uh, movies. I actually have a guest starring spot on uh, SWAT coming up uh, Thursday, I think it's... February 7th. Nice. So James Harrison, the actor, what? You're going to, like, The Rock, the next Rock? That's what I'm be trying to tell him. Listen, I'm like The Rock. I got yeah. action like The Rock, but I got range like Denzel. Oh, so, oh whoa. So you're a double threat. That's, that, I got to call that a triple. Wait. With the range of Denzel and the action of The Rock? Come on. So when you tell Hollywood people, look, I could stop the run and say, rush the passer. I can, I can do that in Hollywood. Whatever I want to say until I got to prove it. <laughs> Bill Belichick, what was your relationship with Belichick and what did you respect about him once you got to know him? Straightforward. Uh, he, he shot it to me like it was. You know, when I got there, you know, he said, uh, you know, what it, what, it, what it is and what it was, and that's what it ended up being. Like I said, he was, he was a man in his word. He was honest. And, you know, he actually is funny. He yeah, got like a dry. I know that. I did a radio show yeah. with him. People don't see it. They don't see it. It's he, crazy. He's a ball buster. Dude. Very funny. Very, like, <laughs> that dry sense of humor funny. Like, the first meeting, I'm like, did he just say what? I'm like, he's funny. Do, do Steelers fans still not forgive you for becoming a Patriot or no? Nah. That's Come on, that rivalry runs deep, man. Yeah, but at the end of the day, um, it's, a, it's a business, you know? And they made a business decision that they felt was best for them, and I made a decision that I felt was best for me. Last thing, prediction for the game. How's this game going to go? I feel like the team that uh, best adjusts to what the other team tries to take away and execute that plan will win. And I feel like that's going to be the Patriots. Good luck, James. Thank you. Good to see you, man.